This has to be one of the most unlikely Great Western survivors, even though she's technically not Great Western. Number 1338 is a relic of 1898 from Kitson of Leeds, being one of two 040 saddle tanks built for the Cardiff Railway, formerly the Butte Docks Company. Boasting a main line of just 11 miles long, the Cardiff Railway was the smallest railway company to be absorbed into the GWR upon the grouping. As such, they only employed tank engines. With Kitson Hawthorne valve gear, itself unique amongst preserved locomotives, number 1338 boasted a tractive effort of 14,259 pounds, so this little shunter was only just off the pulling abilities of an Adams radial tank. The little engine spent most of her working life as a dock shunter, except during World War II when the Great Western loaned her out to the engineering firm of Stewarts and Lloyds. From 1943, she worked the docks around Bridgewater, before going back to her South Wales roots in 1960, this time to shunt the docks at Swansea. For such a small engine, she racked up a huge mileage for her size, being withdrawn in September 1963 with 354,000 miles on the clock. The following year, the little engine escaped the cutter's torch when she was hidden in the bushes at Bleedon and Uphill, where she lay for several years. There was every chance of her being forgotten altogether, but that changed in 1987 when she was moved to Didcot Railway Centre for restoration, running again for the first time in 47 years in the year 2000. You may not think of her as the most important locomotive in the Great Western Society's collection, but considering her sister engine 1339 was broken up in the depths of the Great Depression in 1934, she's been lucky to survive.